Welcome to the show called Let's Visit Iceland. Iceland has been around for centuries. 8860 Iceland had been discovered by the Vikings. It has been around since 8860. Here are some beautiful pictures of what Iceland is really like. So sit right back in an easy chair, relax, and enjoy the next few moments of these beautiful pictures of Iceland. As one can see here, Iceland is a beautiful place to visit and experience. Here is a map of Iceland. Here is the flag of Iceland. Here is the capital of Iceland. Reykjavik was founded in AD 870. Here is a night picture of Reykjavik. The population of the capital days is, is about 118,061 people. Iceland's politics formed the Commonwealth known as the All Thing in 8930. It is the oldest parliament in Europe. The All Thing is a bicameral form of parliament in Iceland. Iceland's All Thing will meet every summer here at Benjvillir. The lawgivers will read and pass laws here from the mountains for the people to hear below. The all thing was Icelandic Catholicism law practiced here. Catholicism was uh, then practiced religion AD 1000. Iceland's first bishop was created AD 1056. AD 1262 civil war breaks out and Norway invades Iceland. AD 1397 Denmark takes control of Iceland. A.D. 1550, the first Lutheran bishop arrives to Iceland. A.D. 1661, Denmark takes control over Iceland by military force. A.D. 1783, the volcano known as Lake erupts, killing thousands of people in Iceland. Here, volcano Lake Lake blooms, sending lava down the mountainside. Smoke rolls up 10 miles high in the air. Thousands of Icelanders were killed and millions more around the world were affected that day. A.D. 1874, Danish King returns Iceland back to all thing rule. Iceland gained its independence in A.D. 1944 and it has self-ruled since then. Iceland is surrounded by three bodies of water. The North Atlantic, the Greenland Sea, and the Denmark Sea. We will now briefly visit Iceland's capital. Reykjavik, Iceland. Here is a picture of Iceland from space looking down at it. Another picture of Reykjavik, Iceland. Here are some more pictures of Iceland to see and enjoy here as you watch this show in your easy chair.
Here is a statue of Leif Erikson standing in the capital of Iceland, who was exiled to Greenland after he was found guilty of murder. The tallest mountain in Iceland is called the Hamnadusgar Mountain and stands 6,952 feet tall. The Havana Mountain. The official language of Iceland is, of course, Icelandic. Most Icelanders live along the coastlands of the island. The chief products of Iceland are agriculture, fishing, and manufacturing. Iceland's main religions on the island are the following, Evangelical Lutheran, Lutheran Great Church, other Protestant churches, and Roman Catholic Church. So think Valentin Lake, Iceland's largest. The Pichosa River, the longest river in Iceland, flows some 150 miles through southern Iceland. There are many geysers in Iceland, also like this one. Some of the geysers can spit some 190 feet in the air. Don't get too close, you could get very wet. There are two of the most beautiful waterfalls that can be found in here in Iceland also. In the north, Dinefoss. In the south, Gofoss. Dinefoss Waterfall. Go Falls Waterfalls. There are many hot springs that can be found around Iceland as well. Like this one called the Blue Lagoon, located in the capital city of Iceland. Icelanders depend heavily on the fishing industry. There are the four main different kinds of fish Icelanders died on. Cape line, cod, haddock, and herring. Here are some farmland pictures and ice cream. for a brief PSA or public service announcement from your local community television station. So get yourself another nice warm cup of coffee or a pop in the fridge and we'll be right back with more of Ice Money. 80, 30, 50. Every mile brings us closer. 25. Every mile in a city near you. 75. Help us stop diabetes. 100. Join the Tour de Cure. 60. Register to ride. 36. Or sponsor a rider. 50. Call 1-888-DIABETES or visit us online at diabetes.org forward slash tour. How many miles will you ride? 25. Welcome back with more of Let's Visit Iceland. Iceland has a president elected every four years, but the Prime Minister is the one who is the real figurehead of the land. The Prime Minister works with the all thing to pass laws. Iceland's population today is about 300,000 people. Iceland is located about 200 miles east of Greenland. 
We will now travel through Iceland on the main highway. Here's a map of Iceland of some of a sample of what our itinerary is going to be like. As one can see here on the map, uh, most of Iceland cities are what are is called coastal cities. We have already visited the capital of Reykjavik as seen here. Now let's move on to the next stop located in northwest part of Iceland. Our next stop is Borgenes, Iceland. Here is Borgenes, Iceland located in the northwest part of Iceland. Here is the, uh, the Harfnajal Mountains located next to Borgenes. Papua Jaw Mountain stands very big. We now visit Blondus Iceland. Iceland is great for salmon fishing. If you're a fisherman, this is the place for you then. Our next stop here on the map is Akuria, Iceland. If you like rainbows to see, this is the place for you to visit. If you like to play golf, a beautiful sunset scene like this is the perfect place to go in Akurnia, Iceland. Against the foreground of the mountain, mountain like here, one can enjoy golfing in a comfortable temperature. Our fifth stop is Megalistor, Iceland. If you like to fish, Lake Lagering is a place to go. It is 112 feet deep. Or you could take a Viking cruise ship and journey on the North Atlantic Ocean off of this town. Our next stop is number six on the map, Hup, Iceland. Hup Iceland population is about 2,200 people. Hup Iceland has a harbor and it needs to be navigated very carefully. The, the popular ice cap is called Vanduchico. It can be seen here as well. Our next stop is number seven here on the map, Selfoss, Iceland. If you like to see waterfalls, Selfoss has it. Beauty 
can be found everywhere in Iceland. Again, if you like rainbows, Selfos has them too. If you like taking pictures of those geysers, this one can be found near Selfos also. Stoker Geyser is one of the oldest known and most world depressive one here is near Selfos. Our main trip is over, but now we will travel through the rest of Iceland. There are still many more things to see and do in Iceland. If you'd like to take pictures of volcanoes, Iceland has some 130 of them for you to take pictures of. Here are some more pictures of them for you to sit back in your easy chair and enjoy. If you are a volcanologist, this is the right place for you to study volcanoes. Of some of the 130 volcano mountains in Iceland, 18 have erupted. Iceland sits on the North Atlantic Mid-Ocean Ridge. It sits between the American and Eurasian plates separate at. Hecla Volcano erupted in 1947 and ended in April 1948. The last one was in the year 2000. Thirsty Island Iceland erupted in 1963 and lasted through 1967. This volcano stayed quiet for nearly 5,000 years before it exploded. In 2010, this volcano erupted on Iceland. It disrupted, disrupted air travel everywhere in Europe and nearby countries. Well, it is time for another brief PSA or public service announcement from your local community television station. So get yourself another warm cup of coffee or a pop from the fridge and we will be right back with the rest of this show. You said. Yeah, come on, you promised. Well, the deal was you had to finish your homework first. Okay. Throw your hands in the air and wave them like you just don't care. Tips on staying involved. Just one of the many ways PTA can help enrich your child's learning experience and life. Join us today. PTA. Every child. One voice. Plant Inspiration. Provide youth with the creative tools and skills to cultivate it. And you'll be amazed at what can grow. 
Adobe Youth Voices and the Peapod Foundation. Learn more at plantandinspire.org. Welcome back to the rest of the show called Let's Visit Iceland. If you are a bird watcher, then Iceland is a place to visit and see them and take pictures of them also. divided into six regions as seen here on this map. The six regions of Iceland are Southwest, West, North, East, South, and the Interior. Sit right back in the easy chair, relax, and enjoy these pictures of the interior of Iceland.
Southwest Iceland. Iceland is a truly beautiful place to visit and experience. Whether to play golf or go bird watching, or go fishing or snorkel diving, or just enjoy the beauty, Iceland has something for everyone. Always remember to plan ahead, book ahead, and use common sense when it comes to your safety while visiting Iceland. Goodbye, Iceland.